hygiene. Yeah, no, um, we're just getting ready. Yeah, no, I'm waiting for Graham. <laughs> no, no, he's, um, he's fine, yeah. Okay. See you later. You need to get ready, Grey. Your mum's just rang. She wants us to be at hers in half an hour. Graham? I'll be ready. Well, um, do you want me to help you? I can dress my fucking self. Did you not hear me? I'll do it myself. I'm talking to you. Are you? Are you bloody talking to me? That makes a nice change. You haven't spoken to me for six whole days. I don't want to hear this. Well, you're gonna hear it! What? What could you possibly say to make this better? Go on then, with your wise words. There's nothing I can say to make it better. Just put your bloody trousers on. So we're finished then. Well, what a lovely chat that was, eh? So much for needing to talk. We'll talk later. Right now, we're going to see your mother. We'll talk now. Get off me, Graham. Why? You're going to cry some more? <sighs> oh, poor little Shannon. Crying about all the things that have happened in her life, eh? Like when a high school sweetheart broke her heart. Or when daddy wouldn't pay for that holiday that everyone else was going well, on. Well, at least I'm showing some remorse. You look like a fucking robot. There we are. Poor Shannon. What do you want me to do? Cry about my life. Like you do about your pathetic one. <laughs> he was my brother. My family. My blood. You didn't even like him. And you said I'm self-involved. Your family's my family now, Graham. Can't I cry for him? All right. We're never going to see him again. I mostly cry for you, Graham. Graham, talk to me. Graham. Are you coming? Graham, are you coming? 